guys, it's Vivian, your hot stock girl. Today I'm going to do my best to explain the Indian stock market. Since my goal is to make us all better investors, if you have any information to add on the Indian stock market, please share your knowledge in the comment section below. The Indian stock market trades on two stock exchanges. The Bombay Stock Exchange, also known as the BSE, and the National Stock Exchange, also known as the NSE. The BSE started way back in 1875, while the NSE started trading in 1994. Stock trades in India do not have market makers or specialists like we do here in the US. Trades take place throughout an open electronic limit order book in which order matching is done by computer. Stock orders placed by investors are automatically matched with the best limit orders. Though this process, stock buyers and sellers remain anonymous. Stock trades Monday through Friday beginning at 9.55 a.m and commencing at 3.30 p.m. Indian Standard Time. Some of the best companies in India con include Tata Consultancy Services, ticker symbol TSE, and Revelance Industries Limited. Tata is a major conglomerate in the information technology industry, while Reliance is a huge oil and gas company. You won't be able to buy shares on the Indian stock, stock exchanges at your local brokerage firm. I think you could consider having some exposure to the Indian-based companies in your portfolio. India has approximately 1.3% billion people and there seems to be a strong push towards educating the population. The most important reason I see to add some exposure to India based companies is that their gross domestic product has been growing about 6% annually. I don't have any individual stocks to recommend on the India exchange because I just don't know enough about these companies. I think the best way to add some India stocks to your portfolio would be to buy ETFs. The Columbia India Consumer ETF trades under the ticker symbol INCO and holds large cap stocks. For small cap stock exposure, I suggest the iShares MSCI India Small Cap ETF, ticker symbol SMIN. Please do as much research as possible if you decide to invest in companies that trade on the exchanges in India. You will be adding some risk to your investments, but you may also be adding some rewards. So there you have it, my understanding of stock market in India. I'm Vivian Hot Stock Girl and please be sure to subscribe below and check out my other videos for my great investment ideas. Bye!